In our record book, summer is considered June, July, and August, and that means meteorologically speaking, it's coming to a close pretty quickly. And in the Hartford area, Windsor Locks is our climate station we look at for data and records. The average rainfall in the summer months is a little bit more than 12 inches. Remember last year, a really wet summer across all of the state. We actually had nearly 20 inches of rain in the Hartford area at Windsor Locks. And you might think it's been just as wet this summer after what happened two weekends ago. Well, the data at Bradley doesn't show that. It actually shows that the precipitation there is nearly average so far this summer. So we have to take a closer look because that doesn't tell the whole story for the entire state. Looking at it from a statewide view, nothing really catches your eye. Most of these numbers are near or a bit above average for summer rainfall. But in the Naugatuck Valley, where about three months worth of rain fell in that one day, two Sundays ago, the numbers are staggering. 23 inches of rain since June 1st in Southbury. Newtown, 26 inches of rain. Naugatuck, 22 and a half. But you don't go far out of the Naugatuck Valley to run into lighter amounts. North Brantford, 16 inches. And on the flip side, at the Danbury Airport, 16.7. And in Kent, about 16 and a half inches of rain. So this was a hyper-localized event two Sundays ago, and the cleanup is still ongoing while in other parts of the state, our precipitation is near to just above average for these three months. It goes to show how weather on a small scale can really change town to town. I'm meteorologist Ryan Breton, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.